I had to come out of hiatus for this one, just to talk about this. Um, if I sound funny, I do apologize. Um, two things are against me right now. One, I'm getting a cold, so my nose is a little stuffy. And two, I had an accident where I bit my tongue pretty hard and developed a couple canker sores underneath. I may share the story with that, um, when I decide to come back from hiatus completely, but I just had to talk about this one. Apparently, YouTube is cracking down on its terms of service. Meaning that anything that is not apparently advertiser friendly is getting demonetized. A lot of YouTubers are going to get really impacted or have been really impacted by this. Um, apparently Scarce was hit with this one. Um, Boogie2988 I think was hit. McJuggernuggets was hit. Um, I think the Black Hokage was hit. Um... Other YouTubers I can see getting hit with this, which I hope don't get hit with this, um, some of my personal favorites, I mean, D Sigs, he's a real cool guy, um, I'm afraid this may hit him, so I just hope not, um, Super Mario Logan, I've never really talked to, um, anyone on that, but, um, I'm afraid they may get hit with this, um, these guys just... They're awesome, and, well, to hear that their videos could get demonetized just because of what they're saying is just, it's nuts, alright? Whatever happened to the First Amendment right to freedom of speech? Like, isn't that kind of what made YouTube great? That you could just go on a camera and say whatever you want? But no, now they're demonetizing videos because of controversial content. Which means anything that YouTube finds controversial or against their agenda, which is more than likely going to be the case, is not going to get money. Now, a lot of people, well, some of you who watch my channel ask me probably right now, But don't you monetize your videos? No, I do not. I do not monetize my videos. For two reasons, really. Three. One, I don't get enough views on my videos. I mean, I'm grateful for the views I get, of course, but I don't make enough views to, like, rake in an actual paycheck and I don't have a proper PayPal or whatever. Um, two, I never really wanted to do that because, well, something like this came up and I don't want that tarnishing my channel and stuff and I have to go all PC and softcore because, you know, I don't do that crap. I'm not a soft person. This is not a kid-friendly channel, and probably never will be. <clears throat> and three, I don't see YouTube as a career for me. Personally, I prefer to write. I'm actually a novelist, and I'm writing books currently for my DeviantArt page and my Wattpad page. I'll give you a link to my DeviantArt since a lot of people tell me it's easier to access. <clears throat> so... Yeah, this is why I don't monetize my videos, because, well, I just don't see this being my direction. Because I find something just kind of getting stale after a while, just pointing a camera at something, and just calling it a day. Like, I want to actually, like, be able to write something. I like doing thought-provoking content. Not that I'm saying YouTube is not thought-provoking content. I mean, for the most part... A lot of YouTube is actually pretty dang clever. I laugh at a lot of it. Well thought out jokes and all that. In fact, sometimes the jokes are just rushed to and they're still friggin' hilarious. Me, I cannot do that. Which is why I prefer to write, which is another reason I'm on hiatus. But other than that, let's just hope that a lot of... Let's just hope that YouTubers get together and actually just start petitioning to get YouTube to change its ways, because more than likely, they are going to use this to abuse their power. Because, I mean, if you think about it, it this is kind of hypocritical. CNN has a YouTube channel, and they're showing, like, all this with Syria and Donald Trump. Those are controversial to some people. Meanwhile, channels like Drama Alert and Scares, who are reporting, like, YouTube stuff... They're getting demonetized. I think it has something to do with appealing to the big corporations. Because, well, if you think about it, YouTube's terms of service are claiming that these 
like language and sexual violence and controversial topics aren't advertiser friendly. And then Mr. Enter made a point about South Park, about how it literally deals with everything mentioned, language, violence, sexual themes, political stuff. They still have all their advertisements and stuff. So I'm definitely on that same boat with Mr. Enter. And it's just like, what are you guys doing? It's total hypocrisy with YouTube here. And they, they need to pull their heads out of their butts if they really want to get something done. I just wanted to make this clear. If you like what you heard here, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Um, I recently got it verified, actually. Um, I can make longer videos now, which means if I do Homies on a Friday Night 10 or 11 or whatever I'm at now on this channel. 9 was on Periscope, a live stream. But if I ever decide to do 10 here on this channel... It will now be in one continuous part, even if it's an hour long. So, how cool is that, right? <laughs> oh, I gotta go. Tongue's starting to hurt still. See ya.